Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How's everything? <clears throat> Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Ready for action? Yes. Yes. You say yes, teacher. So so, and I might yes. That yes. Today has been a very fast moving, busy day. But how was your day? Was it nice? Was it <clears throat> busy too? Nice. It was nice. Wonderful. Nice. Excellent. Very good. All right. Good evening, everyone, my dear ones. Today is December the 7th. And this is class 17, okay? Today we're going to be working on indirect questions. Yes, no questions. So we're going to be working on yes, no questions, indirect questions with yes, no questions. <clears throat> okay, so welcome to your English class. <laughs> These are, this, this is the object mm -hmm. uh, these are the specific objectives right okay and uh, this is the objective for tonight okay and in the agenda we're going to begin with a discussion then a dialogue the explanation of the topic and the exercise, okay? Then the post task is going to be to check the answers. Okay. So uh, these are the questions that we're going to be discussing. Does your company manufacture products? Are production processes updated frequently? Is there a quality control department at your company? Do you have experts build the prototypes? This means do you assign experts to build the prototypes? Are your designers expert builders? Do you need to be an expert to design products? What qualifications are necessary to be a developer? Okay, so these are the questions that you're going to be discussing. But before that, let's, uh, let's see who is present tonight, okay? Let's see. Anna Selmi told me that today she wouldn't be present, okay? Anna Delmi Carranza de Guzman, Okay, Dani Anthony Sigüenza, Danis Adalberto Fuentes. Present. Danis and the Hammer. Yes. Present. Excellent. Eduardo. Morita. Morita. Yeah, good evening, my friend. Eduardo Ernesto Hernández Molina. Guadalupe del Carmen López. Present teacher. Excellent. <clears throat> nice. Jose Carlos Argueta Romero. Jose Ignacio Ovina. Jose Norberto Velázquez. Chair, I am here. Who is, who is speaking? Okay, Karina Elizabeth Villeda. Excuse me, teacher. Teacher, I'm here, Karina Diaz. 
Carolina Díaz, ok. Karina Villedas. Karina Villeda, no. Ok, Carla Verónica Vázquez. Present teacher. Present teacher. Carla Verónica, ok. Present teacher. Present teacher. Cari, ok, Cari. Ay, my dear niñitos. Answering one hour later. <laughs> It's ok, Cari, no problem. Carlita. Present teacher. Excellent. Yes. And uh, Jose Norberto is with us. Okay. I see you, Norberto. Thank you, teacher. Yes, you're welcome. Aquí I am Catalina de Rosales. Marvin Alexander Bonilla. Miriam Claribel Jacobo. Pedrina Iliana Gómez. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Pamela Beatriz Posada. Present. Good evening. Good evening, my friend. Come on board. René Osvaldo Bonilla. <clears throat> Ricardo Alexis Fuentes. Ricardo Alexis. Present teacher. Excellent. And Janira Guadalupe Gomez. I don't know why Janira is in black. Okay. Janira Guadalupe Lopez. No, Gomez de Ríos. Janira Guadalupe Gomez de Ríos. And Rudy. <clears throat> Rudy Josue Flores. Rudy? No. Okay, let's begin. We are, according to this, we are only seven people. Okay. Seven people only. All right, my dear ones. This tells me that we are 14 but only seven people answer present. Okay. And now there are 15 people. All right, let's begin. I'm going to create the groups. Jose Carlos, okay. Excellent, Jose Carlos. So let's see. I'm going to Yes, Jose Carlos, I can see you, my friend. Do you have a question? Okay, nice. Then I'm going to create the groups. We're going to go to the groups and we're going no. to ask these questions. Okay. No, 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 I don't have a question. Okay, nice, very good. Okay, I see you, my friend. I know that you're present, okay? okay. Yes. Thanks. Yes, you're welcome. Welcome on board. Thank you. Yes. So the chat says I'm here. It's you. Okay. Very good. So <clears throat> let's create the groups. We are 15 people present. So four groups. Groups have been created. The groups are opening. We are going to be discussing page eight.
<clears throat> Mr. Ignacio, can you share the picture, the screen? Yeah, I can, but okay. we need to load, load that moment. Big one. It's the same with me. I use a big on you. Oh. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You see the presentation? Do you see? Do you watch? I see. Okay. okay. Does your company manufacture products? Arlita? No. Pool. Cloud for kids. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. And you, Dani? Okay. In my case, yeah. Yeah, for example, uh, I don't know because yeah. it I is. have not. I have not mm. been when the teacher is playing. No, it is, it is one, it is one. Okay, you have to only, only discuss the questions. Yeah. Only ask and answer the questions. Uh -huh. Okay. That's right. Yeah, thanks, Pamela. Okay. Now Hello. I am in a very nice group. That's your company manufacturing. Wow. That's your company manufacture product. Anyone on your company manufacturer? Well, in, in the company that I, I, I work, well, we manufacture uh, garments, uh, clothing. And um, it's anyone Sorry, uh, Pamela, our company yeah. is full service, not, oh, manufa okay. not, not fa manufacturing. Okay, and you, uh -huh. Carlos, the same. Uh, well, uh, number two, our, pro our production process of Update frequently. Frequently. And yeah, uh, Pamela, in yes. our company, we do processes at very frequently. Pump, 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 water, water pump. Um, well, um, maybe in my, in the company and, uh, we not, uh, the production process, it's not a frequency with a lot of frequency. And I don't know if Carlo has, has another answer about his job. Okay, Carlos, what do you think about? Well, if we continue with the number three. Is yeah. there a quality control so, department? Sorry. Hey, Carlos is here. Yeah, is is. If you have a 
in your company are production process of love frequent, frequently? Yes, my internet. Ah, yeah. yeah right now. Uh, okay, no problem. Uh, we continue with the number three. Is there a quality? They have, um, I, I will, I will. Chose case. Chose case is how the, the, the products look like in the store. They make uh, they make uh, window window shops. A or window shop. Windows or mm -hmm. yes. Uh, also they call them shrines. Yeah. Yes. But you can say uh -huh, window shops. Uh-huh. They they are Show experts. Showcase. Okay, too. Showcase. 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 Uh-huh. What about you, Carla? Uh, what question? For this No, in my company, a local company, don't, don't uh, manufacture only uh, only that services okay mm -hmm. do you know about uh, it's off your microphone thank you <laughs> Yes, in my in my company, uh, how are uh, one's uh, department the uh, the prototype? Okay. Yes, is how um how much department? Okay. Over uh, over service. Over okay. Perfect. Okay, number five is are you design expert builders? Builders? Um, I am not. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> How about you, Norbert? Yes, how is it? A little, a little department. The... Okay. Okay. Um, Teacher, the... um, expert builder is expertos constructores in designados expertos constructores in, in different in different world in different. Yes, it could be assemblers, but only, not only the ones that, um, let's say, build houses or build uh, bridges or put up buildings. No, no. But also, you can think about the ones that build uh, an engine. They create the parts and they assemble all of the parts. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Oh, my friend. The next is you need to be an expert to design a product. Question. Yes, which one? Okay. In my company, uh, we are don't have designer expert builder uh, because. Uh, them working for a uh, production of products. Mm. 
in my company has a designer, but no, it's part design. Mm -hmm. In my company, in my case, uh, yes, is uh, the the team for DAD decide on development for different product or new product. Seven. The next question. Okay, the next question. Question: um, the, Do you need to be an expert to design a product? In my case, in my company, uh, we need to develop the system area because uh, because we are oh, we are have a uh, some problem, some some problem, something problem um, day for day for day. Mm. Daily problem, day, daily problems. Todos los días, all days. Day problems. Sí, day, day problem, the system area. Everyday problems. Uh -huh. Okay, everyday of. Oh. Okay. My case is uh, check check and quality or or verification the different moment to a developer in. Uh, for different areas and use the chains. Lupe? Okay, the next. The next question, or oh, Guadalupe? Um, in my company, need to be a, a expert design. For the moment, has a, the client, the volume, the, the, the sample. We are, um, uh, yeah, imagine in okay. design, but doesn't have a expert design. Okay, uh, the next, but the like what mm -hmm. qualification are necessary uh, to be a developer? In my case, in my company, we are need to development the system area. Mm -hmm. Ahí está todo. Okay. It's perfect, right? But you can uh, do a resume about all what we discussed. Yeah, I only have I only have listening to you, but <laughs> my internet was 
awful. However, I restart my cell phone right now. I can listen as well. But okay. See mm -hmm. you in next crop. <laughs> okay. Um, have you finished, my dear ones? Yes. <laughs> Okay, ladies and gentlemen, now that everybody's out of the groups, let's continue. Listen and practice the conversation. Listen to the conversation and practice it. I wonder if you received a copy of the analysis for the production process. I have, thank you. Uh, I have, thank you, Lucia. Perfect. I'd like us to, to revise the steps to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. Right. I'd like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah. That's a good point, Greg. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will be will go very high? Of course, let me revise my files. Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify the revision step or what the revision step is about. Okay, some words, wonder. I wonder if I ask myself, this question, I don't ask another person. I ask in my head. I just ask the question in my head. I wonder, hey, I wonder if I brought my wallet. I wonder if there is life in another planet, okay? I wonder. So questions that are asked in the head, I wonder. So here, I wonder if you received a copy of the analysis for the production process. Uh, she wants to say, uh, in this case, she's, she's asking herself, but she's voicing her thought. Maybe the people can hear what she's asking. Then the other one, analysis, production process, revise. Revise the steps, verify, quality control, quality control. Should be repeated, should be repeated, repeated. That's a good point, that's a good point. Would you mind telling us, would you mind telling us quality control, quality control, go very high, go very high. Let me revise my files. Let me revise my files. Could you find out 
could you find out if the production manager is around? Clarify, clarify. Revision, revision step. Revision step about, about. Okay, so I want you received a copy of the analysis for the production process. I have, thank you. I have, thank you, Lucia. Perfect. I'd like us to revise the steps to verify we're ready to start producing our new shampoo. Right. I'd like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Of course, let me revise my files. Great, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify uh, what the revision step is about. Okay, now this is the conversation and uh, these are the questions. What's a new product Lucia, Martha and Greg are discussing about? In this case, about probably not necessary, you can say, what, what is the product Lucia, Marta, and Greg are discussing? Mm -hmm. Bless, you. Bless you. What are two steps of the production process they mentioned in the conversation? What did Greg suggest about the production process? So these are the questions. Now, so you're going to be working on 10 and 11. Okay to go back to the groups except that the groups are not going to be so extensive okay because they were very big this time 10 and 11. okay we are 17 means that we are 16. 16 four groups of four is too many Mm, but I prefer four groups of four rather than let's say let's make five groups. Okay, everything is beginning now. Okay. Wow. I like to, re to revise the step to verify verify that we are ready to start producing or new shampoo. Right. I like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is. Yeah, that's a good point, great. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Of course, let me revise my files. Great, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay, we can switch. Okay. 
Me, Marta. Me, Lucia. Okay, I am great. Okay. Um, I wonder if you revise a copy of uh, of the analysis for the production process. I have, thank you. I have, thank you, Lucia. Perfect. I like just us the revise the step to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. Right. I like to know if the quality step should be repeated once on the product is at finish. It's finished. Yeah. Yes, that's a good point, Greg. Marta, would you mind telling of the cost to run a uh, second quality control will go very high? Of course. Let me revise my files. And okay. okay, could you find out the out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay, switch the last time. Uh, yeah. Okay, we'll see ya. I'm great. I wonder if you receive a copy of analysis for the production process? I have, thank you. I have. Thank you, Lucia. Perfect. I like us to revise the steps to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. Right. I like to know if the quality control step should be repeated. 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 <laughs> Once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point. Greg, Marta, would you mind telling me the cost to run a second quality control will be very high? Or oh, let me revise my files. Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him, I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay. Okay. We discuss that question. Uh, what is the new product Lucia, Marta, and Greg are discussing about it? A new shampoo. A new shampoo. A new shampoo, yes. Okay. What are two steps the production process they mentioned it in the conversation? Analysis for the production process. What is that? <laughs> In the Lucia, the first line. Ah, oh, ah, yeah. the analysis is the first for the production quality control. Mm. Well, it say about uh, it say about the. Uh, about quality control, but mm -hmm. then say it about the second quality control, right? Yeah. And then production manager, no. Revision, say it about a revision. Um, I don't know if someone has another 
question or you remember something? Yeah, maybe the quality control. Um, three, what did Greg suggest about the production process? Um, well, it said about the repeat once the the product, um, well, it said about the quality control can be repeat once the production, the product, sorry, is finished. Or do you remember something? Mm. No, we're in revision. Yes, right. Well, um, I don't know if well, I think we are finished. Uh, if can we just only three three questions three questions? Uh, well, we are finished. Okay, let's see, my friends. What's a new product Lucia, Martha, and Greg are discussing? What's a new product that they are discussing? The new sham shampoo. New shampoo. Mm -hmm. And what are the what are two steps of the production process they mentioned in the conversation? And quality control, teacher one. Uh -huh, quality control. What's the other one? The cost of production. So re revision step, right? Qual okay, quality control and the revision. And uh, yes, when you talk about the cost of the two steps, Right now, they need to be clarify uh, the revision step. Uh -huh. Excellent. The last one. What did Greg suggest about the product, the uh, process? What did you suggest? To uh, be reported once the product is finished. Uh -huh should be repeated once the product is finished. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. Now let's move on. We're going to get to the explanation. Here, this is something that I don't, that I want you to do it in the groups. You're going to read this part, read the examples and everything, and I'm going to explain everything to you. Okay, so, but in different words. So, uh, this is page 13. Read with, the, with your group. And uh, after reading, uh, think about what things you didn't understand. I'm going to explain all of those things to you. Okay.
the groups are opening. Ricardo Alexis. to in a more polite manager. And in direct question, expressing the same meaning as a direct question, but is does it not present question for order? 1A, I wonder if you receive a copy of the analyze for the production process, compare it to 1B. Did you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process? Uh, second A, I like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once of the product is finished compared to compare it to. To be should be quality control. Step B, repeated one of the products finished. Okay, notice that if you, that if introduce the indirect question, which will have sentence order, uh, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, Ordered subject plus verb, helping verbs like do, does, and did are not included in direct question. Who we'll read the, the next paragraph? Rudy? Hello, Karina. Did you receive a copy of the analysis analysis analyze for the production process? Okay. Uh, well, we need to compare the one A with one B. Mm, did you receive? I wonder if you received. Mm -hmm. uh, well, the first one is not like a question. Uh, exactly. It's, uh, it's like a um, more. Um, I wonder if you received. And the next one is, did you receive a copy? It's more direct. If someone has another question or everyone understand the, the difference? But is number one B. Did you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process? No, verdad? No. 
is is in a paste your thing. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, now that you are out, let's continue. Okay, you finish reading this part. Let's see uh, what we can help you with. Okay, here we have, we have something that is important to understand. Let me use my line. Okay, we say that this is composed of two things. And you say, teacher, and what are the two things? Let's say, yeah, it's okay, the line. Let me see. We have one line and the other line. This line represents the question introduction, introductor. Okay. This introduces the question. Okay. And over here we have this is the embedded question. Okay, you say what's the meaning? The meaning is that this one here is the one that presents the question, and this one is the, the one that is the question. Okay. Uh, normally, normally what happens here is like the introducers can be, I wonder if, normally that means me pregunto, si, I wonder if, it can be something that is inside our heads, we are asking ourselves, but sometimes we say it out loud because we are asking other people and we want the people to listen. It's like, we don't want to ask them directly. Hey, you, can you tell me this? No, I wonder if this and the other people hear and then they respond, right? So I wonder if another is, Uh, let me see, let's have first the ones that are sentences. Uh, this one that appears here, like let's verify, we're going to use that one tomorrow. Today, no. Today we're going to be only satisfied with, I'd like to know,
I'd like to know if or I'd like you to please confirm if Let me put it correctly. Okay. Uh, I need to know if, okay, these are, ex these are not questions. These are statements, but then we have the questions. These are the questions. Uh, the questions are, could you find out if, could you find out if, and of course, at the end, you're going to have a question mark. Another one is, uh, do you remember or could, could you tell me could you tell me if or you can be like can you tell me if it depends on the degree of politeness if you want to be very polite you say could you tell me if can you tell me if another one is, do you remember, if, okay, do you remember if, do you know if, Okay, uh, did she mention if? Let's say, okay, my friends, these are the ones that will introduce the questions. Now, another thing that is important to know, I'm going to put it here, is that if is equals to whether. If or whether is the same. I wonder whether, I'd like to know whether, I'd like, I'd like you to please confirm whether, okay, but, Many times confirm that, like verify that, but right now if. Okay, um, I'm going to do this like this. Subject, verb, complement. And then of course, question mark. Okay, I'm going to make this one as big as I can. Okay. And then I'm going to explain what this means. Okay. This one is the same here. Okay. Whether We have this. These are sentences and these are questions. Okay. Now, but notice how subject, verb, complement. That's the order. I wonder if you have a computer. The question is do you have a computer? I wonder if you have a computer. Uh, 
Do you have a computer? I'd like to know. I'd like to know if you have a computer. Uh, I'd like to confirm if you have a computer. Could you find out if Maria has a computer? Could you tell me if Maria has a computer? Can you tell me? So it goes like this. Now, let's, this is the intro, introduction. I want you to look at this. Have like this. Uh, can you tell me? Can you tell me? I'm going to put this. Okay, this is the this is the first part. What is the other part? The other part is Does Mary live here? Does Mary live here? Okay. Poor Norbert fell asleep. Poor. No, not yet. Okay. Sorry, my friend. You are tired. I know. I'm going to make it short. I promise. Okay. Can you tell me? Okay. Here, why do I use if? Because the question begins with an auxiliary. It begins, it can begin with does, do, can, is, etc. Does she live here? Can you tell me? And then we put the two together. Can you tell me if? And then you remember subject verb complement by by does. If we eliminate does, the verb takes the s, right? So if Mary lives here, can you tell me if Mary lives here? Can you tell me if Mary lives here? Another one. Do you know? Notice, is it safe to drink this water? Is it safe to drink this water? Do you know? And then what do we do? Let us say that not only because I want to be lazy, but because I want to be faster and also because I want you to see what happens, put them here. Okay, so what do we do? Now that they are in front, we say like this, we connect them, we use if. And this word order changes. How does the word order change? We say, do you know if it is safe to drink this water? Do you know if it is safe to drink this water? Okay. Do you remember? Okay, and then here, past tense, right? This is the last one. Did she eat? Did she eat lunch? Did she eat lunch? How do we put them together? Okay, this comes obviously at the beginning and this one follows, right? And what, how do we connect them? We use if here. Do you remember if we eliminate did by by? If and we use the verb in the past. Teacher. Tell me, my friend. 
And they say, can you tell me it's Mary Lee here? Uh, uh, sit, he sit held uh, S. Lead. The word is lead, perdón, lead, lead. Lives. Can you tell me if Mary lives here? You remember that we eliminated does. And, okay, and, and then eliminate does, the S goes back to the verb. That's why, can you tell me if Mary lives here? Has an S. No, la pregunta es, tendría que llevar S ahí donde dice lead. No, debe llevarla. Ah, ok. No la lleva. Ajá. Pero no, no se utiliza en plurales. <laughs> no, Robert. You remember the simple present. Simple present is used, okay. He, she, it, take an S, right? He works, she works. It needs, everybody knows. The S in the verb is not plural form. The S in the verb is a distinction for the third person. Okay, what is not, uh, is not singular and is not plural. Because if it were singular, imagine I is singular, you is singular, right? And you don't say you mm, live. Okay. And you don't say I lives, but this is a distinction it's a distinction for third person, for he, for she, and for it. Yes? Okay, thank you. That is he, etc. Only third person takes an S. And this S is not plural. It's a distinction. Is it singular then? No, it's not singular either. It's a distinction for the third person. If it were a distinction for singular, I is singular. We would have to say I lives, and we don't say I lives. This is an inflection. This is an inflection means a change. It's a change that we make in he, she, it as a distinction for the third, third person singular. Okay. Okay. And Mary is she is third person. Then the verb has to have an S. I live, you live, he lives, she lives, it lives, everybody lives, but we live, you live, they live. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you, teacher. Something else, Norbert. In, in the case when you are using the third person, the auxiliary is does, right? That does he have? But the auxiliary has the S, not the verb, in the question. Does he have? Notice, does Mary live? The S is here. So the verb doesn't have. When you eliminate the auxiliary, the S goes back to the verb. That's why you say Mary lives. OK. Yes? OK. Yes. So wonderful. This is the idea. Why do we use? If, because the question begins with did, is, or does. Okay? So okay, okay. Now you do it, okay? Don't worry, I'm going to share this board with you later. Okay, right now, oops, it's a little late. Let's, let's work on this one. Okay, let me see. This one, be before you work alone, I want to make sure that it's clear. Okay, notice this. Can you tell me if the machinery, can you tell me, is the machinery capable of performing these processes? How can we put it together? Help me, please. Yes, my dear. Teacher is de agregarle allí, entonces. Can you tell me? We say, can you agree and change the verb? Yeah. Tell me. Tell me if. If. It, 
Okay. If, uh, if yeah. is the one that you say in Spanish, si. Sí. Puedes decirme yeah. si ya vino. If. The machine. Ma is. The machinery. Ajá. If the machinery. Uh, if the machinery. Oops. Together. Yes. Is. Sorry. Okay. Can you tell me if the machinery what? Is. Is capable. Of performing this process. Uh -huh. This process. Uh -huh. And question mark. Question mark because it's a question. Okay, my dear. That's number one. Good job. What about the second? I'd like to know will the manufacturer buy new machinery to produce our orders on time? Let's begin with I'd like to know. I'd like to know. No, if. If, if will. If will. If the, if will the manufacturer. Manufacturer. If the manufacturer will. Notice that the word order changes. Will comes here. Will buy. Okay, so I'd like to know if a manufacturer will buy new machinery. So, new machinery to produce? To produce our order on time. Okay, do we have a question mark? Do we have a question mark? No, 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 no. no. Question. Notice that is, I'd like to know. It's not a question. I'd like to know if the manufacturer will buy new machinery to produce our orders on time. Now we can substitute this with, I want, we can change, we can change it for, I wonder. I wonder if the manufacturer will buy new machinery our orders on time. Right? That would be the idea. Now the next one. Okay. Do you know? Do you know? Do you know? I don't know. I don't remember that. The school, the school schedule. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's see. So, I was going to silence, but no. Okay. Let me see. Do you know if notice? What are the schedule? Uh -huh. Okay. So, uh um, what happens? You remember what happened to Will? Will went before the verb. The manufacturing. Uh, what do we have? What's the subject in this question? The schedule, the schedule. and production. These two. Sure. What do we say? If the schedule. If the schedule. Under. Production. Production control. Mm -hmm. okay. It didn't write anything. Uh, okay. I was uh, and it didn't write anything. Okay. If the schedule. If, on production. Our control. And production control. Production control. Uh, 
control forms or are complete. Complete. Conforms are forms are complete. Conforms. And then because it's do you know? It's a question. Do mm -hmm. we write a, a question. question? Do we write a question mark? Yes. Yes, we do. Absolutely. Do you yes. know if the schedule and production control forms are complete? Forms are formularios, right? Forms. It's not the verb, it's formularios, forms. So they want to know if the forms are complete. Okay, four, I'd like to find out. I'd like to find if, out what? If, 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 if is the operation. The operation plan. The operation. <laughs> Plans. If the operation plan, no plan, uh -huh, describes. Notice that the yes comes to the verb. If the, That's the process. The process parameters. Parameters. Mm -hmm. Do we have to write a question mark or a period? A period. Period, excellent. I have been typing all day, so my hand <laughs> like this, okay. Mm. Let's see. I'd like to find out if the operation plan describes the process parameters, excellent. Yes, now number five. Do you have an idea? Any idea? If, if we go for a small mass production, a small batch. Teacher, what is batch? A batch is a group. Yes, batch is a set group. Maybe you remember batch files in when you studied the MS DOS, interior commands, exterior commands. You remember that? No, probably don't remember that. But don't worry, batch is a group. Batch is two several things put together. Batch. A small batch or mass production. Small batch. Okay, they say a small batch production means that they will not have a lot, just a few, or mass production. A small batch or mass production. Do you have any idea if we will go for a small batch or mass production? You remember that the small batch was for testing the prototypes. You remember the focus groups that we created, just a few for the people to give their opinion. And after that, we were going to create a lot for distribution. But once the people gave the okay, right? Okay, number six, I was wondering, I was wondering is, me preguntaba, me preguntaba si, this, ask, I asked myself, right? I was wondering. I was wondering if what? If you receive. If you received the past tense, right? If you received the, the quotes. Teacher, what's a quote? A quote is the, what other people said. Example, Benito Juarez. Esto el derecho ajeno es la paz. That is, it's a quote, okay? 
So then, if you read the quotes of the raw material, okay, no, it has to be something else because raw, has to be a different meaning in this case because raw materials don't quote any. So the quotes of the raw material providers, raw material providers, gives the answers. Okay. I, sometimes my doesn't write. Okay. So do we have a question mark or only a period? Only a period. Only a period, excellent. So I was wondering if you received the quotes of the raw material providers, means what they said literally. Why is it necessary to have quotes when experts speak? Because they use a specific vocabulary to refer to specific processes that if we are not experts, they do something wrong. So we delete right? Okay, so my friends, let's check over here. Um, this is the example. Now we're going to go to the task. Direct question. Okay. Here, the first, the first thing you're going to do is identify the correct, correct question or sentence, okay? Right? In the first one, you're going to identify. Identify. In the second, you're going to create, you're going to make reports. Okay, you're going to begin by saying, David asked me if, Sorry, and for the moment you're going to be using with all of them, with all of them you're going to be using, ask, David asked me if, David asked me if, David asked me if, okay? Right? For you to be sure about that one. Okay, and the next one is this one. You're going to say, can you tell me if, and you have these ones. All right, so only that one, two and three. So I'm going to send you to the groups. Yes, my dear ones, let's go. 16, 17, 18 only. Okay. I begin the groups and there we go. Do you have the picture? Yes. Ya voy, ya voy.
Do you know what time start the pin? I think, Marvin, what is the correct? Yes. C. Sí. C. Sí. There's C. Do you know yes. what time starts the film? Um, I think it's the the A. You know what time yeah. it starts? The same. Richard, what do you think? Why we just get up so early every day? Identify the correct indirect question. In uh, just identify which is the correct, but I think. Mm -hmm. And the, the first, I think the letter B is the, the correct. Do you know what time does the field start? Yes. I don't know. Yes. The one A. A. Yes, yes. The number one, I think, is the letter B. Do you know what time does the field start? And the letter, the letter, the number two. Do you know what's wrong? Hey, Renee. Hi. The letter C is the, the correct answer. Do you know when time start the field? Start the field. Oh, okay. Yeah, the number two. Come on. Okay. Why Amy does get, get up so early every day? Uh, why Amy does get, does get up so early every day? Letter B or letter C? Yeah, a mí debe levantarse temprano todos los días. Se levanta temprano. Why, why? Why you didn't phone me yesterday? Why didn't you phone me yesterday? Why do you? Why you not phone me yesterday? Um, why you didn't phone me yesterday? You're a question. Why didn't you phone me yesterday? Why the little thing? Um, the question five little thief. Little thief. Are you sure why? What? Is, what about letter B? Why you know phone nets me yesterday? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. la, who's the other person that is in the rap Pedrina? Yes. Next, what do you think about number five? 
For me, it's a little seed. Why? Um, Why you not telling me yesterday? Mm. Yes. Okay. Yes, I'm agreeing with you. Why you? The next. Um, so, uh, which is the correct, um, I want to know, um, I want to know what, What mm. well I think maybe it's no is letter A. I want to know what this word means. Mm. Uh, number four, Carla, can you read it? Number four, I can remember where did I park the car. Letter B, I can remember where I parked the car. Letter C, I can remember where I did park the car. I can mm. remember where. Maybe can be um, letter B. Letter I B can, for me too. I can remember where I parked the car. Mm, well, why? A, why you didn't fool me yesterday? B, why didn't you fool me yesterday? I put you more. Yes. Yes. The, the second? David, can, can, can I see David? Can I borrow, borrow your love mower? Mower, creo que es. El I can see. I es como de pregunta, ¿verdad? Yes. Can I borrow your love mower? Lawn mower? Yes. Cortadora de grama, lawn mower. ¿Me prestas tu cortadora de grama? Borrow? Can you, no es, can you borrow me, lawn mower? mower. Uh, borrow? David, ask if I. Can you borrow me? Um, can you lend me? May I borrow? Borrow can is take, lend is give. Can you give me? Can you lend me? May I take? May I borrow? The interview question is David asked me if from Julam. Oh, one more. Sorry. I borrow. Or no? What do you think? Yes. Can I? <laughs> the third. Three. 
David, do you speak Spanish? They Spanish. And tell me. Tell me what do you want? Letter B. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Bless you, Rene. Thanks. Letter C. What? Tell me what do you want? Yes, I think the letter C. Tell me what do you want? Okay. The next page. Report what did ask it mean? Do you live with your father? Do you live with your family? Como que si él eh, no estuviera preguntando. Tell me. Uh -huh. Ok, my dear ones. Report what David asked me. Do you live with your family? David asked me if I lived with my family. David asked me, okay, can I borrow your lawnmower? David asked me if he could borrow my lawnmower. David asked me if he could borrow my lawnmower. Okay, David asked me if I speak Spanish. In that case, you can use the present, no problem. If I speak Spanish, David asked me if I asked me if I would come to my party, if I would come to his party the following day or the next day. Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Here is him. So teacher. asking, right? <laughs> teacher, in in a screen, the report once David asked me is over. He de contestar las question or. No, 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 only transform them. Because, but I will ask you to change David asked me because we, okay. are, we are not ready for that yet. So instead of saying David asked me, change, change it and use it, I wonder. Okay, or, uh, or you can say, yeah. I'd like to know yeah. or that David wants to know. David wants to know. Do you um, like, for example, si, si tu vives con tu familia? Okay. I wonder if 
you live with your family. Only eraser the auxiliary do when we use it. If I wonder if you live with your family. Do do you like it? No listen to you. I wonder if I can borrow your lawnmower. I'd like to know if I can borrow your lawnmower. Yeah, number three. <laughs> Do you speak Spanish? No, I am speaking English. I wonder if you speak Spanish. I wonder. Yeah. Como me preguntaba si. Ah, okay. Okay. So. Number four, right? This guy can be. They be ask ask me if you have seen my car. My dear ones, I think that we are not prepared for this one. So, oh, okay. el, don't use David ask me. Instead, uh, David wants to know. David wants to know. To know if. Uh huh. Yeah. Wants to know if. Only. So in this case, can be David wants to know if you have seen my car. Yes. Okay. Uh, Carla. Like this is like this. We need to make a lot of changes that for the moment. Okay. Prepare. So you're going to say. David wants to know if you live with your family. David wants to know if you can borrow, if I can borrow, or David wants to know if he can borrow your lawnmower, okay? Mm. To know if you speak Spanish, things like that. Okay. Well, Carla, you can continue with the number six. It's the your car. David asked me if you speak Spanish. My dear, my, my dear, um, I think that we are not prepared for this exercise. So instead of saying David asked me, we're going to change it to David wants to know. What, what's the difference? If you say David wants to know, okay, because if you say David asked me, you have to change because it's as simple. The past filter, everything to the past. And we are not for that yet. So we're going to be using David wants to know. David wants to know if you live with your family. He wants to know if he can borrow your own power. David wants to know if you speak Spanish. David wants to know if you will go to his party. The Okay, tomorrow, for example. Uh -huh. Change only that, David wants to know, so that we don't get a chivole. Okay. It's much better, right? If you use David wants to know instead of David asked me. Right? David wants to know. David wants to know if you live with your family. David wants to know if he can borrow your lawnmower. David wants to know if uh, you can speak Spanish or if you speak Spanish. David wants to know if you will com come to his party tomorrow. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you will have a little change, no complication. With this in the past, we are not prepared yet.
Okay. Oh. Zambi Asma. Is that in your right? Eh, podría ser I wonder, I wonder if. Aha, uh -huh, or David wants oh. to know. David wants to know if you live with your family. David wants to know if he can borrow your lawnmower. David wants to know if you speak Spanish. David wants to know if you will go to his party tomorrow. Okay, things like this. I think that that is easier. The other one is in the past. No, let's use wants to know. Okay. Do you understand maths? Uh, David, want to know if if you understand maths? <laughs> okay. Um, number fourteen. Can you play the guitar? Uh, David wants to know. You can you play the guitar? Number fifteen. Can you play the guitar? Okay. Number fifteen. Do you have do you have a Netflix? David, when you know is do you have a Netflix? Is correct, teacher? If you have Netflix without do. Oh. Want to know if you have Netflix. Mm -hmm. Okay. You, have uh, you can repeat again. Are the ones that change order. You eliminate okay. who and does, do, does, did, you eliminate. Was, okay. was, where, is, okay. are, or will only change order. They go after the. Can you repeat the uh, 15? David, one. Okay. David wants to know if you have once but no question anymore david wants to know if okay. you have netflix david wants to know if you have netflix no question mark no question ah okay okay wants to know if you have netflix no david wants to know if you have netflix if you have ah david wants to know if you have netflix okay okay uh, we continue with the next page. Make indirect question, questions using can you tell me if? Okay, number uh, one. I start. Can you tell, number one, yeah. can you tell me if is Mary a university student? Yeah. Yeah, I think this. Yeah. Uh, next one. Can you tell me if she does have a part-time job? Mm -hmm. And next. Can you tell me if she at work has? Can you tell me if she has? Okay. Not Can you tell me? If she if, has a part time. If she if she has at work at five p.m. yesterday. If can you tell me if she was if she was at work at five p.m. yesterday? If she was. She was. Ah, okay. If she was at. One changes order. Ah, okay. This... Can changes order. Will changes order. Has she gone? Changes order. That's eliminated. That's is eliminated. That's in, oh, okay. Do, does, did are eliminated. But is, she is, she will, she has, she can, you can. Okay. Change the order. Okay. Um, number four. Can you tell me if, can you type very fast? Okay, number uh, number five. five. Uh, can you 
for, for rainy is like a, a traveler. Foreigner. Foreigner is an extranjero. Mm. Foreigner. Another place. If do you no, you if do you need if, oh, need if you if you need help with something help with If your class is uh, say p six p.m. p.m. If your class at class. Estás escribiendo por otro lado. Ay, sorry. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Ah. Uh, <laughs> cuatro Z, cuatro Z. Ahí está otra vez. Deshacer. Yeah. Flechita de deshacer. Okay. Well. <laughs> but I don't, I don't. Wow, you finished, right, my friends? No, teacher. In, in this part, I confuse. Okay. In this one, you eliminate, do, does, it, and all of those. Do and does are eliminated. In the case of ifs, changes place. Mary is. She was. She has gone. She will be. She is. Okay. Only does and do are eliminated. So you say she has eliminated us. She has. Okay. She, okay. Does she a compromise after work? Here is I ate that she have that she have a compromise. So you will say here she has a compromise. I ate has. Okay, she has online classes. Eliminate us. She has. She has. You have. You have. Okay. okay. Thank you. Well,
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, the first one. We are in the in the last part. <coughs> we need to choose the correct option. Correct option here. Sorry, you remember subject verb. Letter A is the correct one. Do you know what time the film starts? And number two, why Amy does get up so early every day? Why Amy gets up? Okay, what's the correct form? Letter C. This is not a direct question, a normal question. Why does Amy get up so early? every day. Number three, what's the correct form in number three? Letter, letter A. Why letter A? Because we have uh, what this word means, subject, verb. <laughs> Subject, verb, subject, verb. Four. Number four, we say, I can't remember where, what? Subject, verb, I parked the car. Correct answer, B. Number five. Why didn't the phone, why didn't you phone me yesterday? It's a normal question. Let it be. Number six, do you know where, what, it works? Letter C is the correct answer. And number seven, how much does it cost to park here? B. And the last one, tell me what you want. Tell me what you want. Okay. But then let's go to the last one, this one, okay? And uh, I'm going to use my pencil to help you. Let me see. Mm, I'm going to, instead of this one, I'm going to use this one, red. Let's see, this one is, moves here, here. Okay, can you tell me if Mary is a university student? Okay, let's say this one, this one, this one, this one, this one and this one, all of these change the word order. Okay, so you have like, I want, okay, can you tell me if she will be back soon? Okay. Can you tell me if she has gone to work today? Can you tell me if she can, oops, missing the verb, if she can type our report today? Let me see, missing, here I'm missing type. If she can type our report today, is that the same as another one here? That she, if she has a compromise, so you say have, does she have a compromise after work? So what do we do with these ones? If it's does, 
eliminate does. Eliminate does, eliminate do. But this one, uh -uh, this one does, you don't eliminate it. You only move it to the beginning. If she is a good student, can you tell me if she is a good student? Can you tell me if she will be back soon? Can you tell me if she has gone to work today? Okay, so those are the, okay. If you can type. Okay. If she was at work today, eliminate does. And you say if she has, okay, if she has, if she has a boyfriend, and this one no problem because it's have, if you have. Okay, my dear ones, you are tired. We're going to stop it here. I'm going, tomorrow we're going to be working uh, again. And we're going to be checking this. So let me call roll. Okay. So Amy Carranza de Guzman. Present teacher. Excellent. <clears throat> Dear Niñitos, remember. Uh, to ask your human resource office to send your documents, okay? Register for the next one. Um, Danis Adalberto Fuentes. Okay, Eduardo Ernesto Hernandez. Del Carmen López. Present. Excellent. José Carlos Argueta. Present. Excellent. José Ignacio Franco Medina. Present. Excellent. José Norberto Velázquez. Present. Nice. Karina Beatriz Díaz. Present. Excellent. Karina Elizabeth Villeda. Present. Nice. María Emma Catalina de Rosales. Present. Excellent. Marvin Alexander Bonilla. Present teacher. Nice. Miriam Claribel Jacó. Okay. Eh, Pedrina Ileana Gómez. Present teacher. Pamela Beatriz Posada. Present. Nice. René Osvaldo Bonilla. Present teacher. Excellent. Ricardo Alexis Fuentes. Present teacher. Okay. Yanira Guadalupe Gómez. Yanni. Yanni se conectó. Rudy Josué Flores. Rudy. Yeah. Okay. So. Teacher. Tell me. Teacher. Tell me, Carlita. Don't say my name. No. You prohibit. Don't say my name. You prohibit me to say your name. Yeah. Or you say. that I didn't say your name. Oh, yeah, yeah. Didn't say my name. Oh, I said Carlita. No, I didn't say Carlita. No. Yes, but you are present. Don't worry. Okay, I will <laughs> the ones that are absent. Say, okay, Selmi is absent. Anthony Siguenza, Eduardo Ernesto, and uh, Miriam are absent. I said, Danny, no. Eduardo, no. So they are not here. Yeah. Danny teacher, Danny dijo que habían puesto un baile afuera de su casa, quizás por la fiesta del, del, de ahí del lugar. Uh, como que le estaba afectando. Okay, Danny's. Okay. Yes. Danny. Thank you. 
Thank you, my friend. All right. Well, my friend, uh, Let's see. Don, Don, uh, who stays with me tonight? Don Ignacio stays with me tonight. Now, the other people, thank you very much for joining me tonight. I will be seeing you tomorrow. Don't worry about the things that are not clear. Tomorrow we're going to be working on some of those to make them clearer. Okay. Okay, so good night. Take care, my friend. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Okay. See you tomorrow. Sleep well, take care. See you tomorrow. Okay. Good evening, Don Ignacio. How can I help? Good evening. You? How can I help? Uh, uh, not teacher. Uh, I to maybe I to to give uh, my my uh, agrado. I don't know in in, in English. Uh, I I I am in I am fine in your class. And uh, you know, um, we have a different situation, different problem at, at work in our family and a different uh, side. But for me, eight to 10 p.m., at home is a is a difficult difficult <laughs> no it's a I tire I tire but but I, I, I am in, I am happy it at class I am happy at class but but my my body is a is a yeah, I want to yeah. Yes. Yeah, but I I need a a little change for relax relax the time. Yes. Two hours, two hours for me is um, is a lot. It's a lot. Is many time for me. Yes. Because eight to ten, we and you know, I. I I need take a diner. Yeah, and you need to eat. And yeah, I, I yeah. Include change my my Close. my wear. Yeah, you know, Sarisa, because I don't have time for change the 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 uniform. And yeah. Ignacio, I admire you because of the effort that you make. I know yeah. you are tired, it's difficult. The schedule is a time that you need to be resting, sitting in your sofa, relaxing. But the sacrifice that you're making, wow, I admire you, definitely. Not, in, not everybody wants to you know, make sacrifices these days. And you are sacrificing yourself. So, hey, I'm happy for you. And uh, congratulations. I really admire you. It's not easy. Yeah, it's not easy. Yeah. Por eso, or in English. Reason, for this reason. For, yeah, for this reason, for this reason, I don't have a question for you. Or I don't have a question for the English 
English class. So, uh, Insa for giving me. Mm -hmm. And I, I, I don't have a question for you and only I, I pido. I ask. Uh, okay, I ask. Uh, uh, com, com, Understanding. Com, Understand. I, I, I ask, I ask, understand me, understand me for the, for my face, maybe I, I my face is a, is a tire or I don't know. Okay. But it's, it's only, no more. No, yeah. don, don, don Ignacio, believe me, uh, I admire you and I know, and you know, I was checking the homework and forget it. All of the young people uh, are trying to do the homework, but you have finished all the homework and you have done it there. So congratulations, good, that's a good job. Excellent. So I know it's difficult. I know that it takes time, but okay. I hope that this sacrifice that you're making brings satisfaction to your life because that is the important thing, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, then if you have no question, I will let you go and rest. Well, do the homework. <laughs> do the homework so that you can go to bed early and rest because yes, I know that you are very tired. Thank you for staying. Okay. Thank you. Thank for you. Thank you to, to you. My pleasure. And, uh, yeah. How can okay. I? How can I be angry at you? <laughs> yeah. never, never, because you you always try to do the things well and uh, making mistakes is normal okay making mistakes is normal and you see that i correct you because you are my friend and i want you to say it correctly but i don't get angry no no why on the contrary you participate a lot you work you get in here you do that so how can I get angry? And how can I not be happy that you are in the group? I'm happy that you are in the group because you work hard, because you try, you are tired because you have been working all day, but you give your best in class. And that is important. Okay, so. Thank you, teacher. Congratulations. Okay. <clears throat> Thanks. I will be seeing you tomorrow, okay? Yeah, yeah, see you tomorrow, teacher. Thanks. Take care, my friend. See you tomorrow then. Okay. Good night. Bye. Thank you. Good night. Good night. See you. See you.